good morning guys it is a gorgeous day my hair is looking a mess can you see all that sun it's freaking beautiful day so we're gonna get ready start our day and i'm gonna also give this big dog a bath and the small one over here over here and then put eye treatment for my cat and yeah we're just gonna start our day right are we gonna start our day he's such a baby look you here Hi, Hanson. Are you Mama's boy? Mm. Oh, yes, you are. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Mm. I wanted to show you guys the closets in this room are finally up. Just look at that. It's honestly so exciting. You see? This room is so freaking beautiful. I freaking love it. Oh, okay. The only issue is, I guess, maybe the doors, they don't have, like, little doorknobs or whatever you would have here for easier access. But I guess you don't really need them. I mean, see? Oh, we've got stuff in here. My new carpet's in there. Oh, and also my picture frame is in here. And my new rod is also in here. So a few things are in here. We still have to get, like, kind of organized in here and like you know those things but yeah this is looking nice man i so wish this was my room because like if it was my room i would i think i would have the bed right here two nightstands ignore my dog two nightstands and then over here i'd have my computer desk i believe right in front of this window right here and then on this side oh that might be a tight fit whatever anyways computer desk right here and then my makeup vanity and my dresser here is what I would have enough room for like pretty much everything to sit in. But it's not my room, so sucks. I haven't slept in here. Like I could sleep in here if I want. I want to try it out one day and see what it's like. But I have yet to do that. So yeah, this thing is up. It looks freaking amazing. Hi, Junior. Looks beautiful. Freaking love it. Love, love it. And then right here, this is a picture frame that my mom bought for this room. It's really pretty. I love it. Also, I think, I don't know if I can hang this above the bed over here. I don't think so. I think we're probably going to hang this over here. This is like the perfect spot for it, right by the door. And then, we've never had anything, a picture that we're revealing like this, because you can see her butt cheek. <laughs> but yeah, so another cool thing about here is we have this update thing so puts it upper and dimmers the light and so on and so forth or you could just click it and it'll fully go on and off come on junior let's go baby so there's that update which is pretty great i just got back from the vet for my cat and we got some got eye treatment eye for my cat for his eye infection that he has and we've also got what else We've got, well, that's about it, pretty much. The vet checkup, and we're gonna have to pay for um, his surgery to remove his lump on him, which she, the lady said, like it's probably cancer or something along those lines. A little bit more, a little bit more serious than what Zeus back there. Oh, well, he's not here. He's in my room. A little bit more serious than what Zeus had. Zeus has a lump on him, but it's just liquid fluid, so build up fluid, which could go away on its own, or you could schedule something to get it removed. But for now, what I'm going to do is, so I'm gonna try and get some good lighting. For now, what I'm going to do is schedule the appointment for my cat to get that removed first, because I feel like that's a little bit more important. And then after that, I'm going to, um, get my dog's lump removed it doesn't look too appealing on him it's kind of like like big and bubbly kind of looks like a nipple in a way or like kind of like a weird i don't know it just looks weird and it's a little squishy luckily his is not cancer so that's freaking amazing news but my other cat's a little bit more serious so we're gonna have to pay for um to get his lump removed and also to get to remove one of his um, teeth back there because it's also I think it's chipped or fell off or it's like it just needs to be removed and like fixed and then she said that's what's causing the issue with the eye infection as well so there's that but um yeah I'm gonna have to schedule 
uh, an appointment for that. This is going to be the first major surgery that any of my pets had or any major thing that my pets had. So, yeah. Let's get in. Come on, boys. So, for my lunch, I'm having a salad here. I added a little bit of um, walnuts in here. And, yeah, it's an al it's, uh, avocado salad. So, I'm excited. This is actually my favorite one. Hey, guys. So, we're going to the store. We're doing some last-minute Christmas shopping. As usual. So... It's nighttime. Well, it's not really 6 p.m., but it's dark out, so we're gonna head out to Ross. Hi, sister. Can you say hi? Hi, <laughs> So we got this fitted sheet for my bed. I don't know when to put this on. I'm thinking about maybe waiting until my room is done. Because I currently have these blue ones, which I also like. But I had to get a second pair, so I don't know. We got this thing here. We have one in my bathroom, but we got one for the bedroom here. For my, it smells nice. Keeps the room smelling good and clean. And I'm probably gonna place this somewhere up here for now, maybe. I don't know, or over there. Not sure yet. So this is what the air freshener looks like. By the way, this thing was just ten dollars. It comes with this thing. And then the air freshener, you can get different scents if you want, but that's the one that that one came with. And then to open the back, you can, uh, no, 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 you open it up here. You press this, sorry guys, doing this one-handed is kind of difficult. This one luckily comes with batteries. Which is really nice, actually. Two AA batteries, ooh, it fell out, of course. So sorry guys, trying to do all this one-handed is kind of difficult. So what goes in here is the spray bottle itself over here. And you gotta take this thing off and make sure that this thing that's pointed, make sure you guys keep this thing. I accidentally threw this last time and then I was able to find it again and then I put it back on my bathroom one. But make sure you keep this on here. So what you do is you take this, you put it like this. Again, make sure this thing is sticking out like this on the edge because when you close it, you're going to need it to stick out over here. But before you do close it, you can set the timer for how many times you want it to go off. So there's, you can see there's a 9 minute, 18 minutes, 36 minutes are off. I'm going to put it for every 36 minutes, which I feel like is good enough. Then you close it. Oh, it's almost sprayed in my face. Okay, you guys heard that? It smells good. So... If you want to spray some more, you just press this. You saw it, and it sprays from there. But this is pretty freaking amazing. It looks nice and modern. Hey, kitty cat. And it looks gorgeous. By the way, we did take him to the vet, and we got some eye drops for him. I think I mentioned that already. Maybe. But anyways, this, I think, where I'm going to put this for now, I think over here, just for now, for the time being, right there. And look at this thing. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I love that thing. So I got organized my desk. It's a complete mess right now. Got some cake because I've been craving sweets for the longest. I decided to not put my new sheets on. It's right here. I'm going to wait till my room's done and then I'll add those ones. But I did wash these. All of this here. So I'm going to tidy up my bed and everything and clean up this area because it's a little bit of a crazy hot mess right now. Here's a quick update on my room. So this wall right here along the window and that wall has been is it i think grind or whatever smoothened out so there's no bumps nothing it looks beautiful there needs to be a coat of i think primer or something along this wall and this wall here so the room's slowly coming together so then we'll need to do the primer coat and then some my paint color of choice paint and then do this around here replace these things because they're red they need replacing and yeah i'm excited I took the curtains off my crystal lights off so that'll be easier for everything but i just can't wait i'm super stoked so we put the rods up here or the we hung the rod temporarily with the curtains because if i don't have anything here people will see me and yesterday I didn't have any currents whatsoever. So this wall is white. Well, it hasn't painted yet, but it's white primer or whatever. But 
No, there is going to be white primer. But anyways, um, I don't know what to do, guys. I want to either make this wall an accent wall or this one. I want to make this one black, but every time I tell everybody in the house, they're like making fun of me because I want to make it black. Like, mm, it's going to look weird. They don't see the vision like I do, but I don't know. I could leave everything white, but I feel like a white wall is kind of plain. I could do a very light gray, like the one that my mom has in the new living room. See, this is my current wall right here that's dark gray, which is nice, but maybe it's not the best for a small room, so it could feel brighter in here. So I guess I'm going to have to go with a gray one. Here's Osric, beautiful as ever. By the way, guys, if you want, I did create a GoFundMe um, fundraising thingamajigger for my cat Osric here for his surgery. Which is going to cost around 600 could be more plus more to send a sample in and then the vet as well. But just for the surgery and the, to fix his tooth and everything is going to cost 600 And then 90 to send a sample in of his thing that's there. And then also money extra for like his appointment and then probably extras for anything else that he might need. You know, maybe like meds after surgery or something. But a total is just 1000 You don't have to donate, but if you do, you know... Thank you in advance. Even a dollar helps, honestly. Anything. And to those who have already donated, thank you very much. Honestly means a lot. This is my carrier. I am going to donate, you know, hopefully if there's money left, I'm going to donate some of that to um, somebody on GoFundMe to one of their pets to pay it forward. So I think that'll be really, really sweet, you know. Look at him. He's my love. Hi, love. Hi, mommy's boy. He's just the best, guys. He's been with me for 13 years. He's the best. You're a good cat. And he sleeps with me every single time. Hi, Swig. You ready for your eye treatment? I'll show you guys the eye treatment that I put on him. Oh, he thinks it's a snack or something. But hold on, let me grab that. Sorry, guys, I'm doing this one handed. This is. The eye treatment. You put one drop on his right eye. Oops, sorry, that one over there. Every 12 hours, I cleaned his eye up. And it looks like it seems to be getting better. It hasn't gotten dirty again. Hi, love. So if you guys can donate, even a dollar helps. Or if you can't, that's fine. No worries, you know. No pressure, I guess is what I'm trying to say. But if you do, thank you in advance. He's so cute. I'll have the link down in my description if anyone's interested. By the way, if you guys remember, I got this thing that says Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. It's like a board with like lettering and I put those letters on there. I already lost one letter. I forgot which one. I think it was the H or something, but then I added the new one. So yeah, this is just my little stand shelf here. And I thought that would look good there. It looks cute. Those are the dollar store ornaments that we put up. Or I did. And that's it for my room, plus the little lighting on here. I just can't wait for this to be finished and just have my room back. I want to have this bed facing over there so I can access my closet again easier. So excited. This is my kitty cat. I'm just honestly excited to get everything where it should be. Jump and press and, and square. You're going to jump. What you got to make So jump? press X and then square. What you mean? Oh, yeah. The train. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> She's in a car. <laughs> wow. <coughs> Jump a little bit. Do a flip. Do you want to try a Can you know how this is? So this is my Christmas dinner. Some plant-based meatballs with spaghetti. And I'm watching Stephanie Sue. So yeah, Merry Christmas guys. Time to hang up this beautiful piece of art. I think I'm going to put it up here. So I'm going to move this bedding. And I'm going to add this one. I think. Because this one's ripped as you can see over there. So I need to add this. And then I need to clean the side of the thingamajiggers. And then yeah, my room's almost completely done. Right, Astrid? Well, at least for the cosmetic issues or the decorating, I should say. So I wanted to show you my room. 
This is what it looks like right now. It's semi-complete. Ignore that right there. I need to wash that, so I just moved it there. Or I'm going to throw it away. I'm not sure yet. I'm going to see how this blanket is. See if it keeps me warm or not. But the bed is up. Remember these walls, guys? This wall is pretty much done. I hung out my picture. This was like 100 something from Wafer. If I remember, I'll link it in the description if you guys want it. Um, this wall is also done. We hung out the frames or the new black rods that we bought, black mat, with my current curtains. And then <clears throat> my mom added these sparkly curtains over here, which are really pretty as well. Actually, really love them and they go really good with this because you see they're both sparkly and shiny. And then my desk is over here. Tripod or phone pod, whatever is over there tripod phone phone mount i don't know i think it's a tripod it's in the corner there but this is what it looks like here love my black rod mat looks great curtains down here makeup vanity is right there for now could be pushed more towards the middle so maybe i'll do that today or tomorrow i'll move it towards the middle but it's fine there i added my mirror back a couple of my candles and things as you can see some random things pumpkin still there I need to cut this open and feed it to the crows. And the bed here, it's got my kitty on. This blanket is one of our blankets. And my mom said I can have it for my room, so I have it in here for now to see how it is. Usually these type of blankets with like, these things are too hot for me, so we'll see how this one goes. I don't think it'll be as hot to be honest, because the other one I had is like really fuzzy. The blue one, if you guys remember. Another picture, and then over here. So the two walls that are not done is this wall needs to be completely cut out and redone and painted white or gray like these walls. And this one also is pretty much painted but it's just temporarily because this whole wall will be taken down too and there will be new closet doors. But let's look here real quick. So desk is looking good. I got this blanket on here so I don't you know mess up my chair or anything. So I have it on there. I hung this picture. It's a little crooked I think. I think it is a little crooked, but that's fine. This one up here. I will be probably getting a new sign. Because I don't know if I want to keep that anymore. But for now, it's fine. I've got my little pit bull picture here. It's just some random pit bull that I kind of like and decided to put it up there. I love my desk because it has like two fish tanks. This is what this is here. Ignore my sticky notes. They're just random things. Purse. This thing for it to smell good. It sprays it out. And then here is this. This is my favorite part of my room. Let me turn off the lights so you can see. Yeah. It's beautiful. These are the ones that were in front of my window for Christmas lights. But I took them out and put them here. In front of my closet door. <clears throat> Sorry, I think I'm losing my voice. So you can see this whole closet wall. We just painted over it. My mom did. She painted over it. And... For temporarily, but then in the future, all of this will be gone, and I think this entire wall will be a closet. One door, two doors, whatever it is. Um, I think it looks pretty great. We added these picture frames here. Love these ones. I've had these for quite a while. There's that. Got Junior down here. Hey, Junior boy. So I think everything, hi kitty cat, is looking pretty great. That's it for my room tour, guys. Oh, I forgot this fish tank still here. But this is just my room for now. Again, there's still a lot of things that need to be done. Like, for example, so these two walls are already done, right, guys? These two are done. This new wall needs to be finished and fixed up because you can see the old lines here from the original wall, which needs to be cut out and straightened out. And then this needs to be painted to this color to match. This color is the same color in the new living room. It's a little bright. I'm not used to it. It'll take a while. And this whole thing will be cut out and it'll be all closet. And then we'll have to redo the ceiling one day. Get rid of this weird design up here. And stuff like that. So, so far so good. Let me know what you guys think of my room. And if you like it, please give it a thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.